Hi everyone, this is Dave from geekanoids.co.uk and today I'm going to be showing you the new Dock Expose feature in Apple's Snow Leopard. Now Expose before used to give you a quick way of finding the window that you want but now it's even better moving extra functionality down into the dock. First let's just take a quick look at the new Minimize feature. Now before you would uh, double click on a title bar and that particular window would minimize into this right hand area of your dock. Well in the new Snow Leopard operating system if I pop into my system preferences and then into dock I can actually select to minimize windows into the application icon by putting a check in this box here. Now when I shrink this window down either by double clicking or using command M it actually shrinks down and minimizes behind the application icon. If I click on another window, minimize that down, that also shrinks down behind this icon here for Firefox. If I want to look or expose what windows are minimized, I can click and hold and it shows me the two windows that are minimized for this application. To bring the windows back, I simply click on them and this brings them back up into the main work area. Next up we want to activate Expose to show you exactly what it does. On my system I have F3 as my Expose shortcut key. If I push and hold that now all of my windows are in a nice grid format. I can hover over individual windows and press my spacebar this gives me a zoomed in view of the particular window. I can also sort my windows now as well. By holding down command and pressing the 1 key, it sorts them into alphabetical order. If I hold down command and push the number 2 key, it sorts them in application order. I can also push tab just to show windows for the application that is highlighted here in the dock. Push tab again, it shows me just my finder windows. Tab again, just my Safari windows. And tab again, just my Firefox windows. If I have a combination of windows that are minimized as well, then it will also show me those when I tab through in this bottom area here. When I found a window that I want using one of these methods, then I can simply click on the window to bring it to the front. Now you could do this before but I still want to show you that you can actually drag things between Windows 2. If I use Expose to show me my windows here I'm going to highlight this particular window, bring it to the front. I want to drag this file here into another finder window so I've clicked and hold and I've got the ghost image there of the file I want to move. Click my expose shortcut key. I want to drag it over onto this hard drive here. And let go and it's copied the file across. Moving expose down into the dock has added some nice functionality. I certainly like what Apple have done with it. It makes it a lot easier to use and I'm sure you'll find it a great improvement too. Well, thanks very much for watching. More Snow Leopard coverage will be coming soon from geekanoids.co.uk. This video review is sponsored by BMI Solutions, the largest reseller of document scanners within the UK, with a price promise guarantee.